Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you've ever tried to render your project in DaVinci Resolve and hit the dreaded error, the fusion composition on the current frame or clip could not be processed successfully, you know how frustrating it can be. But don't worry, today I'm going to show you exactly how to fix it step by step so you can get back to creating without headaches. First, let's quickly break down what's happening. This error pops up when DaVinci Resolve hits a snag with a fusion composition. Maybe a complex effect, a plugin issue, or a corrupted node. Sometimes it's as simple as a setting that needs to be changed. But the good news? The fix is often just a few clicks away. Here's the fastest way to solve this error. Open DaVinci Resolve. Go to the top menu and click on DaVinci Resolve. Select Preferences. Click on the User tab. Go to UI Settings. Find the option that says Stop Renders when a frame or clip cannot be processed. Uncheck this box. Click Save. Now. Try rendering your project again. In most cases, this will let your render complete, even if there's a problematic fusion frame. Just remember, check your rendered video to make sure nothing important was skipped or glitched at the error point. If you're still having trouble, here are some extra tips. Play through your timeline and see where the render fails. Disable clips one by one, press D on your keyboard to isolate which fusion composition is causing the issue. Right-click the problematic fusion clip and choose Render in Place. This bakes the effect into a new video file, which is much easier for Resolve to process. Go to Playback, then delete Render Cache and select All to clear out any corrupted cache files that might be causing problems. Make sure your GPU drivers and DaVinci Resolve are up to date. Open the Fusion tab and try disabling or replacing complex nodes or effects. Sometimes turning off features like the keyframe stretcher can fix the issue. To avoid this error in the future, keep your software and drivers updated. Use consistent frame rates and formats in your project. Regularly save and back up your project. Use render in place for complex fusion effects. And that's it. With these steps, you should be able to fix the fusion composition render error and finish your project without stress. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more editing tips, and drop a comment if you have any questions or want to share your own fixes. Thanks for watching and happy editing.